cliche. G'day folks and welcome to something a little bit different. This is a cross between a bit of a let's play and a mod review. So, <laughs> uh, introducing to you the re stupid horse, the rediscovered mod. Uh, the rediscovered mod is a combination of all of the things that had been proposed and suggested by the makers of Mojang. Shut up while I'm doing my intro. Um, they'd been suggested, but necessarily hadn't kind of gotten through, or they didn't have time, or they were too difficult, or for whatever reason, they didn't make it through to the final cut of Minecraft. Uh, so it's been put together in one little mod, uh, and there's a few bits and pieces. The whole point of this is um, getting to some place up there. Some place up there. Which uh, which is the whole point of this series. Which I'm hoping to actually just be short and sweet. It's just going to be a tiny, itty bitty series. Um, but let's get into it. So first and foremost, it is going to be quite vanilla. And uh, as you can see, I've got a bit of a savannah. There's a savannah surrounding. I'm in a plains. It's it's nothing unusual. I'm using Ozo uh, as my texture pack. And yeah, let's just get some... Look at this pretty plant. Look at this. This is definitely because of the... Let us sneak around the edge. Because of the derpiness. See that up there? Uh, this is definitely an oak. So I have not used Ozo too much. Um, and look, I just got some wood. Because uh, it is quite a oh, uh, authentic, uh, uh, ye olde worldy style texture pack. Um, I like my cartooniness like uh, Doku, which I haven't had, actually had a chance to use that yet. Um, but uh, Chroma Hills, Svax, all those, they tend to be the texture packs I lean towards. Now, wait, give me that wood. Give me that wood. Um, so... Let us get into the series. Obviously, first and foremost, I need some shelter or whatever. Um, I need some wood. I need a crafting bench. All the staples that would go with a series. Um, whether it's lucky or enough, lucky or enough, <laughs> lucky or not, that I've come across this area with horses. There is something to do with, well, not with the vanilla horses, but to do with a uh, four-legged horse type breed um, that didn't make it into, look at that, I got an achievement, didn't get into the final cut. Uh, but you guys may have seen on um, Mo Creatures that um, horse mobs, scary horse mobs, are involved in this uh, mod. Uh, they are only, I believe, the slimy or undead uh, horse mob, I, I think they're called, and skeleton. So they don't have the nightmares or um, the bat horses. It is just uh, just the two, the slime or undead and the skeleton horses. And I didn't mean to do that. This is what happens when I commentate and don't pay attention to what I'm saying. Obviously, this first episode of... I'm, I'm thinking this may be just like a four-episode kind of thing. Um, yeah, it's um, it's it, it may be boring. I'll see what I can do as far as not having to show you guys the off-screen stuff. But uh, you can only cheat so much, you know? You know, man? First and foremost, I'm going to need some food. Uh, I'm going to need some torches. And um, I'm going to need... I think I think for this one, because it's going to be quick, I'm not going to bother... This is a really beautiful surroundings, though. I'm not going to bother um, building a house. Because that's not really the point. I'm going to try and get some resources. Which, for this mod, the uh, rediscovered mod, does include a ruby ore. Uh, which is, oh, hello. Uh, this isn't actually overly good, seeing as I haven't... I don't know how dark this is, guys. Uh, I'm pretty sure my brightness is up to the utmost. Let me just do a bit of strip mining here uh, and see if I can get some coal. Okay, I did a bit of strip mining, and um, the time, honestly, for the time I want to take with this isn't worth it. I'm going to make some charcoal. So let's 
have a look and um, I've got plenty of cobble now. Enough wood to make myself a crafting bench, which I believe I have anyway. Uh, let's get rid of this savannah tree. No need to plant any more. It's kind of an ugly wood when it comes to crafting stuff. I don't know if you guys agree out there. Um, it's In this texture pack it's kind of cool, but generally it's very orange. Uh, it's not really my kind of thing as far as crafting, unless um, I'm going to be crafting a carrot. If I'm going to be doing a pixel like carrot, then sure, acacia wood's fine. Um, what's, oh my god, are you kidding me? Right, after all of that, and now I find coal. Yeah, okay, that's, um, that's not inevitable at all, is it? Shut up, horse. So I know I haven't given too much away, guys, and uh, and you may have had a moment to uh, Google what we're up to here. Is there anything I can? Oh well, I'm gonna need a uh, gonna need a sword. Um, after the staples, which I've pretty much I've got my sword, I've got my pickaxe, uh, and there's trees and all that around here. Obviously, I'm gonna need food, right? Uh, one of the staples for this mod is I'm gonna need a bed. Um, so, scanning and sun's going down, that's not going to be helpful. Let's just get at least eight, twelve torches. There we go. So I've at least got twelve. Let me be able to find my way back here. So I've got my crafting bench and my furnace. Um, I'm going to need sheep because with the rediscovered, oh, is that white? Is that sheep or is that white horses? Oh, you sirs are going to die. I need to make myself a bed. Because the rediscovered mod takes you into a sky realm. And to do that, how did I get, is that grey? Yes, I've got three and three. Uh, and to do that, there is a chance of reaching the sky world by sleeping. So you fall asleep in your bed and... I'm not quite sure. It's like maybe a one in ten chance. There's wood. Uh, one in one in whatever. It's it's a semi rare chance that it will actually take you to this realm uh, called the Sky Realm. And my food's running low. Uh, and it will, yeah, it will send you to the Sky World. Uh, you have to find a village which is manned by uh, pigmen, not zombie pigmen. But pigmen, pigmen, um, I don't like that little spot there. And um, they're, it, they are holding captive a green cloaked villager, uh, which is a villager, again, one that was proposed but never uh, came to fruition in regular day Minecraft. Um, and you can trade. Now it says in the wiki you can trade uh, with the diamonds. It doesn't say that you necessarily train with either the pigmen or this captive villager. I would kind of assume it's the captive villager. Let's see. Now, I'm going to bed. So, it's another day in the overworld. Alright. I am determined before recording is out, my dears, my dear subscribers, that um, you will see this sky world. So I think uh, in this day I have now, actually my health is going down. I was going to try and, I'm, I'm going to do a strip mine down there. How about we go and get some food? So let's see our direction. I am facing east. You can see down there you've got the X, Y, Z and then the F3 says east. So I am facing east. Oh, wrong button. Uh, let's, hello horse. Let's go east in a straight line and see if we can get some food. I'll meet back when I've found some food. Coming up to home and I've picked up some... Oh, lilacs. Oh, it's so pretty. So let's put some lilacs by the entrance of our little hole and get some of that pork meat in because I'm... I think I'm down to, like, less than an apple. Um, so I'm, I'm, I'm already sluggish. I need some foods. I definitely need some foods. That's enough. 
let's not waste it while it's not necessary. So, farmland, meh. I think I'm just going to utilise the meats that are around me. Um, weapons, I do have to do some mining, so I'm still going to use this area here to do a strip mine. Beautiful. And, um, I've got my bed, so I think we'll just wait for one more night. One more night, and let's hope that it sends me through to the sky world which is the whole point now down in the description below i will give you the link to this mod and will it it will explain everything else that is available i don't really want to give away too much because from what i read the sky world is pretty damn impressive for what it has to offer um as far as size anyway i mean there's i've told you about the pigment oh Here's a new thing as well. This was discussed, I believe, by Jeb. Maybe Dinner Bone, I'm not quite sure. But um, when you were in somewhere that was big enough to fish in, that there would be actual fish. And you could get a fish from, from the fish. And look at that. That was actually like three little fish mob, and I got three fish. It wasn't like your mo creatures where there's, like, you can kill a bunch of them and, and just get a small handful of fish. Um, that was fish for fish. So let's chuck them in the furnace as well. I'm just kind of trying to kill time until it's night time because I want to try one more, one, once more to, to be able to take you guys to the sky world. <gasps> I got delicious fish. I forgot. I thought the, well, the achievement specifies you need to catch and then cook. Uh, cook fish. Uh, I guess with this mod, you don't act well. I guess in general, you don't necessarily need to catch them. You just need to have them and then cook them. Uh, it is. I've just peeked outside, and it's probably about three o'clock in the afternoon, as the Ender Dragon flies. Have I just landed down in that strip mine? <laughs> oh dear God. See what I meant about this bloody texture pack? Uh, but I have torches now. That's just creepy as hell. There was little children. Uh, what? And I've got a stone sword. Stuff should have spawned by now. Wow. That was, honestly, guys, if that didn't creep you out, then there's seriously something wrong with you. Not just grass. I can hear lava. Ooh. There must be something pretty epic loading up in front of me because, uh, wow, yeah, I'm getting a struggle here. So maybe mining ahead of me is probably a really good idea. There could be a spawner or, dang it, no, I can't be out of, no, it's, I uh, know that's dirt. Let's get some more sticks. 12 sticks versus 10 coal. I'm fine with that. Uh, there's another way down there, but I'll... Whoa! That torch came right, right up in my face. Hello, Skelly. Sorry it's dark, guys. You can't really see this epic kill. Did he just drop his bow as well? Oh, nice. What is... And it's almost new. You derpy skeleton. And there's the iron that we need right above our heads, guys. So this is actually really ore rich. Let's get... Oh, I've just turned around on myself. Ha <laughs> uh, ha! Let's get the iron. Get out of my way. Enough to at least get, I guess, a pickaxe and a sword. Anything else is a bonus. Usually what I do, I don't know about you guys. You know when, like... Look, there's ores trapped up there, and you might mine out here. If you're low on your pickaxe, instead of mining these three out, how about you place a block? Look, place a block, and it pops out. It just knocks it out. Did you not know that? I am so full of information for you. This is why I'm here. I'm not... Sorry, that scared me for a sec. I'm, I'm not going to go down here just yet, even though there is stuff to be done Let's just light that up. There's stuff to be done down there. I'll go down there later. 
It's got to be coming up to night time soon. So second try to try and get to the sky world. Yes, I can. Oh no, I don't want to go up there. Let's go this way. Um, where did I come from? Oh, I came from up there, didn't I? Yes, right. Boom, boom. And torture, torture, torture. Oh my god, that's beautiful. See, no wonder my friend plays this texture pack. That's really stunning. Okay, let's... All that aside, what have we got? We've got food, we've got unnecessaries, we've got... Se yeah, whatever. Let's see if we can get to the... Um, sky... No, again, it's just sleeping. Okay, so this is the third sunset. Third time's the charm. I've got some iron, actually. No, that's a crafting bench. Let me take this iron that I... Ah, oh, look at that. Acquire hardware. Just in case, because it's only a chance it will happen. Fingers crossed, guys. No. Nope. Well, folks, as the sun sets here on, I think it's night five, but how many ever you see, I still haven't made it to the new dimension of the sky world. Uh, but how beautiful is that? The sun setting over the savannah. I will come at you next time with episode 2 of the Rediscovered Mod, uh, which I'm pretty impressed with so far. I haven't even shown you guys half of it. Not even half of it. So guys, as I always say, don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment on my video if you want to see more. If not, all you got to do is say good day to your neighbour. <laughs>